guys welcome back to our channel thank you so much for tuning in to today's video on the house of luso if you enjoy don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel let's get into it look at these beauties here we have the panerai luminar marina 42 millimeter 1392 and the remarkable rolex submariner in stainless steel Here we have probably one of the hardest Rolex watches currently to get your hands on. Believe it or not, we were lucky enough here at the House of Luso to not only buy this watch from an authorized dealer at retail cost, but we did so without any purchase history whatsoever. If you want to hear more about the story and how this came to be, then just stay tuned. The Submariner is built to withstand the depths of the sea, 1,000 feet to be exact. This is a 41 millimeter in oyster steel with a black ceramic dial. The Submariner's rotational bezel offers key functionality to this watch. Although it's meant for a diver to be able to accurately monitor diving time, you won't see ours in the water anytime soon. The movement offers a 3230 caliber and has a power reserve of just under three days. The bracelet is the oyster steel three piece link with a folding safety clasp with Rolex glide lock extension for easy and comfortable adjustment. It almost feels like this watch was made for you from the moment you put it on your wrist. For those of you that don't know, Rolex recently had a price increase in 2022, bringing the Submariner up to $10,500 here in Canada. As with all luxury goods, price increases are just part of the deal. Rolex has quickly become one of the world's most coveted watch brands. Unlike Panerai, Rolex's popularity is here to stay. The story behind how we got the Submariner is not unique to us, and I'm sure a lot of what I'm about to say will sound familiar to those who also bought this watch from an AD or ones who are still on the Rolex journey trying to secure one. Bottom line guys, you need to visit as many ADs as you possibly can and try to build somewhat of a report with a single sales associate from each store. This way, you have the best chances of getting your dream watch. The AD we got lucky at, like I said, without any purchase history, was the very first one we visited, coincidentally. We got a call in March of 2021 after putting our name on a list in the fall of 2020. Because our city was in lockdown when we got the call, we had to pick it up right away without being able to get properly fitted. Once restrictions lifted and retail shopping was allowed, we went back for my husband to get fitted as he needed some links to be removed. We were treated very well by the staff and even got a Rolex baseball cap to take home with us. I know you were probably waiting to hear some magic formula on how to score a stainless steel sports model from Rolex, but unfortunately, there is no secret. It just came down to a bit of luck for us. We do hope, however, that our luck wears off on our viewers and you can also take home a Submariner. If you want to leave any comments about how you scored your dream Rolex, please let us know in the comments below. The PAM features an automatic movement with an open case back, which the current model, this feature has been removed, unfortunately. This watch has an hour, minute, and seconds hand with a date function. The strap is black alligator and the bezel is polished steel. We were able to purchase this watch off a private seller for $6,500. As you can see on the screen, this watch currently retails for over 10K. This one came with the box and all papers, giving peace of mind that it is authentic. But of course, you need to do your own research and due diligence before buying anything secondhand, especially at this price point.
The gentleman we purchased it from purchased his from the Yorkdale store and had it for less than a year, so the condition was near perfect. Penarai is a brand with a long and rich history, originating back to the 1860s in Florence, Italy. Italy will always have a special place in our hearts here at the House of Lusso. Did you know the word Lusso actually translates to luxury in Italian? Panerai crafted their watches for the Italian Navy from 1940 to 1980, so they know what they're doing when it comes to watches built for the water. Panerai finally launched internationally in 2001. If you've been eyeing this watch, we highly recommend that you go for it. We honestly can't recommend Panerai enough on this channel. I hope our video offered our viewers some new perspective when it comes to Rolex and introduced the Panerai Marina as a viable option when looking for a stainless steel sports watch as the alligator strap can easily be exchanged for a rubber or steel bracelet. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe and like the videos you enjoy. Thanks guys, see you in the next one.